Hey, Brutus, come here. The dog, Brutus, is still a little shaken up. Come here, Bob. His owner, Jerry, wasn't sure if he'd ever see him again. He's more like my kid than my dog. Brutus got caught in the middle of a crime spree Monday. It was so quick. It was like, whoa, this guy has a gun. Whoa, he's shooting. Whoa, he's in my face. Minutes later, Jerry's truck was full of blood and bullet holes. Note the windshield. Police shot and killed one of the alleged carjackers. The other went to the hospital after being shot multiple times. They didn't care. They had nothing to lose. Jerry doesn't want us using his last name or saying where he lives because he's afraid friends of the accused might come after him after what he witnessed when two men got out of this car on the I-5 overpass in Grand Mound. Two suspects who I have no clue who they are jumped out of the car, tried stealing the car in front of us, shot that car a couple times and ran at our vehicle with the guns drawn. The men drove off with Brutus in the back seat. Jerry says police opened fire on his truck. Two days later, oh, it still bothers him. Anger, hurt, your dog's gone, not knowing if the cops shot your dog, not even knowing if your dog's alive for about six hours. So yeah, it was, it was kind of an ordeal. Prosecutors say when that suspect who was wounded multiple times gets out of the hospital, he'll go straight to the Lewis County Jail where he will face charges for what happened here and potentially homicide charges out of Oregon. Live in Thurston County tonight, Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.